Hello, great tens, and welcome to this lesson on exchange rates. Currency is the term used to describe the particular money system of a country. South Africa's currency is the rand. In the United Kingdom, it is the British pound, and in the USA, it is the US dollar. When we travel overseas, we need to change our currency, rands, to the currency used in the country we are going to. We do this exchange using an exchange rate. Every currency has a unique symbol. Let's take a look at the ones we see most often. In South Africa, we use the Rand, and its symbol is a capital R. The United States of America uses the US dollar, and the United Kingdom uses the British pound. In many European countries, within the European Union, the euro is used. Let's look at some examples of working with the exchange rate. Slinile is going to England to visit her friends. The current rand pound exchange rate is 12 rand and 50 cents to one British pound. She has 20,000 rand spending money for her trip. How many pounds will she have to spend in England? First, we need to calculate the value of pounds that one rand can buy. The exchange rate is 1 pound equals 12 rand 50. To find the value of pounds, we buy with 1 rand, we divide both sides of the equation by 12,50. This means that 0, 0,08 pounds equals 1 rand. The next step is to multiply 20,000 rand by 0, 0,08 pounds. So 0, 0,08 pounds times by 20,000 rand gives us 1,600 pounds. So Slindile will have 1,600 pounds to spend in England. Let's try a slightly different example now. John wants to buy a gaming console advertised in a US catalog for 600 US dollars. The current rand dollar exchange rate is 10 rand and 43 cents to 1 US dollar. How much will the purchase cost in rands? Why don't you try to do this on your own? If 1 dollar equals 10 rand and 43 cents, then 600 dollars will equal 10 rand and 43 cents times by 600, which equals 6,200 and 58 rand. So the gaming console will cost 6,258 rand. Sometimes economists talk about a stronger and weaker rand. Let's look at the example of the rand dollar exchange rate changing from 9 rand 50 six months ago to 10 rand 43 now. Let's see what these different exchange rates will do to 10,000 rand. When the exchange rate was 9 rand 50 to the dollar, 10,000 rand would buy $1,052.63. Now that the exchange rate is 10 rand 43 to the dollar, 10,000 rand only buys $958.77. The exchange rate of 10 rand 43 gives fewer dollars than the exchange rate of 9 rand 50. When we can buy less dollars for the same amount of rands, we say that the rand is weaker. The exchange rate of 9 rand 50 six months ago gave us a stronger buying power, and so we say that the rand was stronger then. There are advantages of a stronger rand at times and advantages of a weaker rand at other times. Each of these currency situations influences the economy of a country. Advantages of a stronger rand are that imported goods become cheaper, the oil prices are cheaper, the petrol price drops, the rate of inflation drops, interest rates drop. There are also some advantages to a weaker rand. Exported goods earn more money. More money comes into the country, more jobs are created. That concludes what you need to know on exchange rates. Thank you for joining us, Grade 10s. Remember to look at the tasks for this section in the Finance and Growth Task video.
You can also find more resources on this section on our website, www.mindset.co.za forward slash learn. I hope your stronger knowledge on exchange rates will help you exchange grades with a positive trend, of course. Goodbye.